Hi, this is I'll explain. This time I'll be talking about some of the collection that would not be on the channel for a while. There are a couple of reasons. Well, not the GM at the back. That is just another GM that I got in the whole box, but separate issues. Anyways, um, first of all, personal customized units and variations or combination units. I did made Charles Jugog as one of my first batch of videos, if not very first batch of videos. And it's kind of okay because I have a Jugog that I will talk about recently, you know, somewhat recently. And Charles Jugog is also one of the few personal custom mobile suit that is also a test unit. Now you can say it the same thing to set a unit free armor color. But but unlike Jugog which have a very good reason why they give ace pilots their custom mobile suit first giving them the pre-production Jugog first and having them figuring out how to use the Jugog the setter number three Amro color is a different story Amro pretty much have this in a side story after the fact and after Zeta is completed years after that we got this and it's not it's not tied to the Zeta's development it's maybe tied to the Zeta Plus development but that would be the Amro Amro Zeta Plus A or Zeta Plus A flight test color so this is in that limbo so and I know there is a and well I wouldn't know I rather so basically I hold this off until I work on Zeta presenting to you what Zeta is then we can get into you know the unit 3 the whole thing about unit 3 and why there is a Amro Ray color when Amro didn't really have his own color scheme until like after the Grips War pretty much or very late into the Grips War that's when you see you know Zeta plus A type armor color or test flag color anyways that's you know and and this would fit into that topic so and I would need a bit more armor ray color to talk about that topic so that's that um, Super Gundam is simple I have to talk about Mark II first although I can talk about Gundam Mark II by just removing the G Defender but um, I also have a Mark II I just haven't get to fit Mark II into the schedule for reasons well but you know anyways and then GB02 the most known um what, what should what should it be the most well-known unknown Gundam the the very Gundam that everybody kind of knows but not really know what's going on with it it is very weird that GB02 does require some background on GB01 to work despite they are literally separate projects in fact I think it's easier for me to talk about GB03 and GB04 instead of talking about GB02 without GB01 and it's very odd but you know that's that's 
kind of how things goes. Oh, and these guys are not regular release, but oh, that's another thing. These guys are not regular release, so I have them and pack them separately. And uh, yeah, I I'm actually in the process to put them in another type of storage that would be easier for me to pack them out for making videos. Oh, also I make this video because when I made the Zaku 2 F2 Zeon type video and you know about the updating updating video I didn't look at the schedule and go hmm I should have a free form non-scripted video now but uh, I don't want to give away too much despite I already shown the Goof be free. Anyways, um, because these guys will not be in videos that coming because these guys wouldn't be in videos coming out soon. So I decided, okay, I will show them off. Not close ups, just they exist in the line. Um, I will definitely give them some panel lining so they look better on camera but you know that G-frames not that much to do still but yeah um, I might talk about more on I may make video rather I will make video about these guys articulation um, as a company video after I explain them because they do have a lot more articulation than regular G-Frame and it's worth to talk about a bit more about those again I there's a direction that I would like G-Frame to go but I also feel like I wouldn't say the ship is sailed but there is another line that there are bobo suits that is not quite exclusive but easier to get in that line that I think I will make a video soon-ish so until that point then we will talk about I want to say the future of these lines but what I would like to see them grow into Thanks for watching, see you later.